Oh hey, we're back in this area. Hey guys, my name is SegaBOT1 and welcome back to Let's Play Sam and Max at the Road Blind. Uh, as you saw in that brief cutscene at the beginning, I went back and figured out where the clump of hair was. It was actually in the guest shop. Also, Frog Rock. Hello, Frog Rock. Do you have any froggies? This is just a frog. This is just a rock. This is the rock. Hey, pick up that rock. Oh, Max. Use Max on the rock. I can't use these things together. What if Max really wants to use a rock? What if he wants this to? This is a completely unusable thingamabob. Well, you're squeezing it. Let's squeeze the rock. Actually, I know what you're supposed to do because I kind of looked it up. And I have it right next to me, as a matter of fact. It's pretty, the hair here for some reason. I can't use these things together. No? There we go. I guess I thought I was cooking on Max. Alrighty. What is he doing? That's gross, Sam. Oh boy. It's Sasquatch hair. So now what? Hmm. Uh, mole man, magic mole man's powder? Do I even have that? Do I have the powder? No, I don't. Uh, oh wait, I gotta... I, I didn't bring all the clumps of hair together, so I gotta put them all on individually, I guess. That's gross, Sam. Yeah, I'm doing. Or did that not even take away from my inventory? No, it did not. Okay, it did. It did. So let's just put all three of them on, because I know we got three, three clumps of hair. I don't know why they make us keep getting hair. Wait, it's like... Isn't that removing evidence from the scene of a crime or something? Um, we're gonna have to go get some sort of powder. I... I don't even remember that. <sighs> Gotta go back to the mystery vortex and do all that stuff over again. I never gave the mole man the the magic ring. So yeah, I kind of forgot about that. I, I do have it, right? I, I I went and fetched it. I thought I did. No, no, I didn't. Never mind. Okay, so on the ball of twine, I guess you're supposed to combine the string that we got from the ball of twine with the golf ball. I can't thing. use these things together. No? Then what was that? Then what was that? Hmm. Oh, hand from a jar. Okay, that makes sense. There we go. Now. See, without a walkthrough, I'd be lost, and it would, this would not be fun to watch. <laughs> I don't think it's particularly fun to watch. It's a side project, okay? Okay. I don't think this is going to last very much longer, so enjoy it while you can. Part 6, Sam and Max hit the road. Hmm. Okay, no, I don't have to, to do that. I can just go in through here. So it is there. I'm just so used to going up to the restaurant because, well, it seems to where, be where all the action is, and there doesn't really seem to be anything at the bottom of the ball of twine. So, let's use the contraption. Oh, I already have it selected. Here we go. Let's find the mood ring. If we can. Oh, there it is. I see it. <laughs> Genius. Genius. He got it. That was wholesome. Wholesome. Not to mention physically improbable. Who cares? <laughs> Who cares? It's it's point and click game. It's point and click. Furthermore, your anthropomorphic dogs and rabbits. Uh, an anthropomorphic dog and rabbit. I don't even know why you're complaining about the physics of your own universe. You just were in a place where you grow, grew or shrunk without any particular logic or reasoning. Uh, we gotta go back here. We gotta go back here. I almost forgot about the mood ring. I just thought that I had to go to Frog Rock to do God knows what. Lay hair on a rock. I don't know how we're supposed to know that again. Into the mirror we go. Remember I said how I wish there was a thing that allowed you to speed through the parts you've already seen before? Well, I then I remember the escape button skips those kinds of things. It's like I've I've known this since the humongous entertainment days, the days when I would play those at least. Let's go through the door. Also, the magnet was already on and I didn't have to do anything. And how's that for being observant? I just assumed it would reset, but okay, fine. We're back. You're back. Yep, I that's what I just said. A bread box. I would hope so. Three bread boxes, even. Okay. What do you want now? Well, we found your moon ring. Is this your ring? Um, you're not stopping a check. 
right. Cool, man. Have you found Frog Rock yet? Yep. Yes, but I don't see how that's going to get me any closer to Bruno. Finding yeah. Frog Rock's only the beginning, man. Once you're at Frog Rock, you'll need some samples. Oh, oh, oh samples? okay, so that's how I'm supposed to know. Yeah, man. Bigfoot samples. You know, fur and stuff, three of them. Smear them all okay, over so Frog Rock. That's how I'm supposed to know. Put the okay. fur on the rock. Got it. Let's go, Max. I already did that. <laughs> Wait. You'll yes. also need some Mystic Mole Man powder. You right. must be joking. But he's no not. No joke, man. Here, I'll get you some. Please. I'm just gonna walk over here. Here you get. Oh. Okay, it's in the treasure chest. Here you go. Which means I could have easily Sprinkle just. This mystic I could have opened the chest and just gotten it without having to find your when you moon ring. It all over Frog Rock. What'll there happen then? Something wonderful. I'm Max. not reading Let's the walkthrough, so right now, so I don't know what's gonna happen. So, uh, but I'm guessing it's going to end with drugs. Some, and something with drugs is going to happen because you know what it what happens when you see a guy talking like that and he gives you something that you don't know what it is. It's probably drugs, and you probably shouldn't use it. Don't don't put it up your nose. Don't smear it all over your face. Don't eat it. Don't. I always forget that I can't click the ground in order to move there, for some unknown reason. Use the car. I'm gonna play this game again! No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Back to Frog Rock, we gotta add the powder. And I walked through pretty much spoiled what I had to do. Damn it. Okay, powder time. Where's the powder? Where is the powder? I know I- oh. It's a golden sack. I wasn't- I didn't know what I was looking for. I guess. Okay, sprinkle. Wait, I've heard that sound effect before. Well? I've heard that. Wait for where, it. Where have I heard it? I, probably someone's YouTube video or something, but I don't know. Sure gets dark quickly around here. <laughs> Somehow. I don't think this is a natural occurrence, Max. In Do fact, I... I think we're witnessing a celestial convergence of some sort. Do you think it'll make that rock look more like a frog? Probably not. Aliens. Okay, now aliens exist. Aliens. Oh my god, it what? Oh, you look like someone else I've seen. I can't even remember who. Like one of the moles. What are you doing? Go to burn Bumpsville? Okay. This means something, Sam. Yeah. Did all that work <laughs> just to unlock? Conroy Bumpus's place. That's what I assume that is. It's got to be the place where Conroy Bumpus is from. It's like, did they name the town after him, or well, well, it's a last name, so somebody, probably someone in his family found it, or maybe he found it. I don't know. Yep, that's a mansion. Yep, that's a mansion. <laughs> it's a Conroy world after all. If we ever get this rich and famous, I want you to shoot me, Sam. Um, It'll be a pleasure. Mm -hmm. Especially after that stupid gator golf thing. Okay, let's see. Can I pick up anything here? Uh, I can't pick up the music notes. I can't pick up his stupid head. Um, this is the guy who made... Uh, this is the guy who made Florida Georgia Line famous, isn't it? Because if that's the case, I want to squash some heads. Oh, can I use this? It's customary to throw money into these things. Ah, okay, thank you for that. I see what you're doing there. I wish this game were over. I don't. Oh, what? <laughs> Hold it. Get back here. <laughs> of course. We're dealing with a very literal well here. <laughs> okay, so I didn't use all our money. <laughs> Uh, I I clicked off the screen. Now that it's gonna matter. Okay. Can you use anything else? Mm, can you look at anything else? Uh, yeah. So, no. You don't have to look at things very often in this game. You just have to use them. I I guess. Do you have anything else to say about this? A wishing well. Yeah. I wish I had absolute power to decide who lives and who dies. I think we'd need a bigger well. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's knock on Conroy Bumpus's door and conk him in the face with a ball. Oh, he's not home. Or is he? No, that's a pay that's a standout, of course. <laughs> Excuse me. Let's take a look at this ugly portrait. Cripes. 
Hey, Max, take a look at this. It's titled Me, Myself, and I. Hey, you learned how to read. I mean, is it really that hard to learn how to read if you're... A pro what the? What the? Uh, can I pick up anything up? Up, 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 up. He's not my type. That's a robot. You're supposed to reserve that for living characters. Can I... Uh, but if that's the case, can I talk to him? Can I... Can, the mouth is open, but I mean, I'm clicking, but he's not... I can't talk to that. Well, then why is the teeth chattering? Uh, let's just switch back to the... the yeah, seriously, the game got a lot of, more bearable with the switching between actions once I figured out how to do the, the shortcuts. Okay, can I, can I use this guy? Can he even get close to that guy? He should be able to, just... Climb Howdy, partners. Oh, wow. I'm Conroy Bumpus, and welcome to Bumpusville. It's just the house. Feel free to wander the mansion, but for Pete's sake, don't touch anything. Just for that, I'm going to touch Howdy, everything. Partners. I'm Conroy Oh, he's just going to keep repeating that. That's going to be... That's not going to get irritating. I got an email. I got an email. I'm going to pick up something. Well, that's that's picking up Max. I don't need to do that. It's a portrait of John Muir. Oh, apparently I need that. Say, Sam, just who is John Muir? No one knows. Who's John Muir? Hey, guys, this dope doesn't know who John Muir is. Uh, you gotta be kidding. What a maroon. What a nib cow poop. <laughs> nib Sam, cow poop. the dead animal heads are talking to me. Where? Up there. Enjoy. Well... Mm. But well, not you really shouldn't tell fibs about dead animals, Max. But stop bugging me. I'm admiring this portrait of John Muir. That but you happened to John steal. Muir? Do you really want to know? know? What? If you'll stop talking, sure. Okay. <coughs> Hit it, boys. There once a was a man named John Muir. Oh, it's not quite. A whatever. naturalist, noble and pure. His love for all beasties. The most and the leasties. Has never been equaled. Uh, That's not quite a achievement. Sure. What? I think that Max is more confused than he was before. Let's see what else I can pick up slash use. Um, I guess that's about it. I, did I talk to the guys? No, I can't. Because Sam doesn't even know they're alive. Okay. Bumpusville is proud oh. to present the Master of what? Piloting, the King of Country, I think Mr. We found Entertainment, I think we found Bruno. Bumpus. I hate really floor know? shows. I remember my childhood in Brighton When dear old dad would bounce me on his knee He'd say, son, there ain't nothing as exciting as exposing beasts to inhumanity. That's why I'm. There's no drums. Happy to be king of the creatures. I'm proud to be the lord of the old. I love collecting things with grotesque features. It makes me feel like some Chaldean god. Oh, I trapped my first tiger before I could speak. Killed me a bear when I was free. And now with this Bigfoot and giraffe neck freak, I finally have a full menagerie. Hit it, boy! Okay, this is this is actually pretty swanky. <laughs> okay, that's Thank better than most you. country music that's on the radio right now. I think you'll have to agree. I hope he didn't see us. And get the hell out of here. <laughs> anyway, anyway, we we found. We found Bruno and 
giraffe neck girl, but uh, I'm gonna assume that light is bad for us. It's probably gonna alert Sulu's presence. I have an idea. What if we use this on this? No? I don't seem to be cooperating. I don't know why you just walked back in there. Get back here! Get back here. Uh oh. What the name of Jethro Clampett's going on here? Ouch! Uh, <laughs> knock it off! Of course. Aye. But how did he not see us before? How did he not see us before? And okay, stay no. out! Well, let's just be persistent, because persistence is key in these kinds of games. At least that's what I assume. Let me go over here. Is there anything of note over here? Well, there's two doorways. This is a car. Wow! It's Monster <laughs> Truck Weekend! Well, it is Happening Saturday. Sunday. Well, it's Saturday. Sunday. Sunday! Okay, I'm over the shock now. The shock of I'm not, seeing but a monster I'm sure car. My gentle naivete will survive. Um, how did he? I don't think he's gonna be able to get this car out of here. Just saying. Um. Hmm. Okay, I guess we gotta use the escalator. Are we gonna drive this puppy? Are we gonna drive it? Are we gonna drive this puppy? Can we pick something up? Like this pill? Okay, I can pick up the pillow that has. Well, if I was any other let's player, it'd probably say something that you all know that I would say, but mm, I had to say moss. Disgusting moss. That is what is on that pillow. Also, why are there pillows on a monster truck of all things? I mean, come on. This is a completely unusable well, thing. I'm a pick it up. Uh, that's, a, that's not happening. Okay. <laughs> that's not happening. That hurts. Knock it uh, off. <laughs> okay, then. Okay, I guess and we got to stay out. No, we're not staying out. That's not gonna happen. I'm sorry to say, we are going to steal all of your stuff, and you cannot do anything about it. I don't think that was the best way to get the toupee, Sam. No. No. What? What? What was your? What gave it away? You mean the guy, the the dumb idiot who kicked us out of the house, or or the flashing lights that happened before then? Okay. Let's try one more place. Let's try over here. Oh, okay. I'm here! I'm gonna talk to you. Don't I know you? I don't know. You ever in the Pensacola camp for problem children? No. Nope. No. Well, that's where I spent most of the last ten years, so I don't see how we could have met. Okay. Um, I saw Bruno. How can you stand to work for someone who persecutes harmless beasts like Bruno the Bigfoot? Uh, on my feet? He's got you there, Sam. <laughs> so, what's this Conroy Bumpus Yahoo really like? Has he got any deep, dark secrets we can exploit for monetary gain? Probably. Hey, don't be cast no aspirations toward Mr. Bumpus. He busted me out of the youth camp, gave me this high-paying 475 an That's hour job. That's not a lot of money. Taught me how to speak Swahili. I mean, found a baboon's heart for my I don't think 725 is really that good either, so... Too. This is pitiful. Of course, this was 1992. I don't know if there were different standards for wages back then, but... Ah. Don't you have any misgivings about hunting harmless freaks like Trixie? I did, but then I took a couple of aspirin. That'll fix it right up, I guess. So, what's all this virtual reality equipment for? The way I understand it, Mr. Bumpus uses a sophisticated virtual reality scenario to interface with the mansion security system. The devil, you say? Okay, and then I gotta shut that off. The devil! The devil! Yeah, sometimes Mr. Bumpus lets me use the equipment. I pretend I'm over a hundred feet tall and everyone else is like ants and I just squish, 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 squish. We get the picture. Okay. Ah, skip it. I'm going. I'm going back. Apparently there was something I could get in the bedroom. Because apparently it was a bedroom. That's why there was a pillow. Of course. I'm gonna get that blue book up there. Oh, do I have to reattach this? That's weird. And then we we'll use that on there. From from the monster truck, of course. So this this really is a bed. That's why there were pillows on it. Let's what you doing? 
We're gonna look. Hang back, buddy, and observe my magic. This, uh, is... First, I'm taking the magnet off of the golf ball retriever. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay. He already did that. Okay. There we go. It's still kind of creepy that we're using a hand like that. Like a severed hand. A real severed hand. Or is it real? I don't know. I mean, with this game, you'd never know. Oops. Mm hmm. Yeah, you can take the book off of his face anytime you want, buddy. But nope, you're gonna read it when it's on his face. You are a jerk. You know what? Forget what I said about just Max being a jerk. You're cut. 15 hours? 15. Find that all you need to know? Maybe. I got a little lost in the troubleshooting chapter. Um, uh, okay then. Um, I'm gonna use you. I guess I know how to use Now that I read this. that ponderous manual, I can move the robot around like this. All right. I'm impressed. That's nothing. Watch this. So Sam knows how to use this thing. Oh my God, Star uh, Star Wars. Okay. That was gratuitous. You know, Sorry. It is LucasArts, so I shouldn't be surprised. This might be more useful. <laughs> what are we doing? Uh. Okay. Um, so, this would be the room, right, um, let's just turn off everything, there we go, that should, okay, uh, don't we want everything red? Hmm. Plug in the blue wire, okay. Alright, then let's go. I don't think the cute little robot wants to follow its new programming, Sam. I don't recall giving it a cute little choice. Go! There he goes. Woohoo! I'm ripe with anticipation. I thought I smelled something. Now can we grab the thing? Oh, there we go. What the? He's gonna kick the robot out, isn't he? <laughs> Al Pavlovian. Awesome. And you should know. Awesome. Now can we grab this? Well, the guy's distracted, so we must be able to. This is a completely Holy unusable thing in the box. No. Okay. Still no. I should have known. That's still no. Hey, oh, come on. Knock it off. Oh my God. Okay, we gotta use the helmet. Okay. We can do that. And stay out. Well, you know what? I think maybe this episode's a little long enough, so I'm gonna end it off here. Hmm. I think we have to avoid tripping the alarm, Sam. Yeah, 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 let's save. New save will be called... Ain't worth the whiskey. Because I heard somebody playing it in their dorm earlier today when I was waiting for my laundry, so, and country, you know, country, so yeah. Ain't worth the whiskey, okay. Take care.